you're looking for a unique, naughty destination, then Iceland is a country for you. Iceland has a population of only 330,000 people, and to make sure no one is dating someone in their family tree, they have a dating site that lets you know who's related to you. Proclaimed as the world's most feminist country, Iceland was the first country to have an elected party formed and led by women, and first to have a directly elected female head of state. In 2009, they elected the world's first openly gay head of government. Iceland has paved the way for women's rights and is one of the few places where women are encouraged to speak out about prejudice and sexual harassment. In 2010, stripping and profiting from nudity were both outlawed. However, many strip clubs have turned into bikini bars, which you can learn more about in my blog about a naughty Iceland. Iceland's Penis Museum holds the world's largest collection of penises and penile parts. Most exhibits are animal penises, including whales, bulls, seals, and even a hamster. The museum also claims to own elf and troll penises, and it acquired its first human penis in 2011 when a 95-year-old Icelandic man died and donated his member to the museum. Make sure to stop by the gift shop where you can get penis museums to take home to remind you of your naughty travels to Iceland. Icelandic food hasn't changed much since the Viking Age. If you want to try typical Icelandic food, then you need to be open to trying new things and not be worried about being on a diet. You will definitely come across some strange and unusual items on the menu. So expect rich foods, some fried, and meats and fish. Looking for naughty things to do at night? Then check out my blog for sexy bars, strip clubs, drag shows, and much more.